Alrighty guys, we're gonna be teaching you all about the Lilia matchup. So some of you probably play against Lilia a lot. She's a very popular champion. One of the most played champs in high elo. And believe it or not, this is actually one of the best matchups for Kane. It's kind of why he's played competitively. Give some little background on it. Kane versus Lilia is a matchup that is just incredibly favorable for Kane, especially since they nerfed Seeker's arm guard. So, yo, yeah, Giddy, thanks for that prime. So, pretty much the thing is with Lilia is that um, she's very fast mobility, but so is Kane. She's very squishy. Even if she builds defensive stats, she still has very low base stats. So very easy to one shot. The only hard part is getting your form. So if you struggle with getting your form, practice some form getting techniques and you should probably, probably be able to uh, win this matchup. I'm trying to see if I could bait. Oh, that's so crazy that he walks in that push like that. Jesus, that was so risky for no reason. Uh, I think I'm gonna go start red, just full clear. He tends to full clear too, so we're both gonna full clear. I doubt she invades, man, that'd be weird. I probably should have warded my blue. You always have to be careful that people would invade you, but Lily is one of the least likely champs to invade you because she's just going to do her own thing. You do your own thing. You do you, she does her. It might do a late invade on my bot side, but we have exhaust and ignite, so I think we win. It, that would really come down to a smite war. The one that you have to be very careful of getting late invade is Olaf. But no, nah, Lily. So, want to know where she's pathing towards? The huge thing with this matchup. So we're gonna see right now. It's like bot lane did leash because Draven's a little low on mana. Unless that's from earlier. Cause look top. Yeah, I don't think I don't think top leash. I think top was just hiding. He waited too long anyway. He didn't use his Q at all. You can tell because he's full mana bar. So if Draven was a little low on mana. I'm gonna guess that she started blue. I'll ping out where she is in the next coming of minutes. I use one pot right now. So yeah, this matchup isn't too hard. It's gonna full clear like every matchup. Some matchups you don't want to full clear, you want to like invade or punish or something. But uh, this one, let's do this. Perfectly fine. Um, and just do this. Gotta be careful. She might go to my blue and grow up to try and cheese me. I would just come down to a smite war because I do this so healthily that I don't think I have to worry. I'm just going to keep pinging where I'm pretty sure she's at. You're going to be able to tell exactly where she's at by how Diana plays, which side she plays. Whatever side she plays towards is where Lilia is. My second pot here. It's a very fast full clear. 305. Nice. Yeah. Let me ward right here for him. So he has some uh, some idea. It's gonna keep ping where I think she is. I'm not sure. Actually, I should probably ping down here now because if she's not at the top scuttle, that usually means that they're at the bot scuttle. So I guess she did start red, or maybe she did something weird. I don't know. I don't have vision of this push. I'm gonna smite it. Oh, there she is. That is exactly why you do that. I was right. She did path where I said she did. It's good. Keep those things in mind, and you will be good. Okay, so now she's doing bot scuttle. The double long sword. See, the main thing you have to make sure is that Lily only wins this matchup if she gets ahead and you play stupid. So just don't play stupid. Play smart and you win. I have a winning team, so this is definitely in my favor. But most games tend to be in your favor as Kane versus Lily. It's literally one of the best matchups. But some people aren't good at getting their form, so maybe they struggle in the matchup. Okay, so I have a reset here. As long as he lives. Say, as long as she lives, we probably fight that, but no, 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 that was not good. Well, I knew that Lily was there, probably should just pick him off. Looks like Lily is taking that and then just resetting. Really upsetting. She gets a 1 0 star. I'll just full take the camp. It's gonna respawn at 658. Bot side scuttle should be on. I'll ping on where I think she is.
In this matchup, you do not want to go tier. It's another snowballing matchup, similar to Graves. You want to snowball because you don't want her to ever be ahead of you because she can power farm really, really easily. And she could just stay on the map forever. So look, she's already almost six. She's, she's one camp away from six. I think mid XP and a kill, she's going to be six right now. So that means she can force a play. Whenever you rush six, you can force a play. So yeah, she's definitely in favorable. What I'll do is I'll just get boots another long sword. Go oh, tier. Tier is only in matchups where you need to scale, but not this one. Be against like a tank jong if you had like if you had like squishy mates. Typically you never want to go red into Lilia, by the way. Thought I'd throw that in there. Gonna sweep both pushes. Okay, so no vision means that this should be an easy setup. All they have to do is just bait. Yeah, there goes Thresh. And perfect. Just gonna go for the freebie here. Um Yeah, I get six. I was gonna smite the cannon at six, but it's fine. Lily is close to six. She's not quite there. She reset and just ran straight pods just trying to counter gank. So she's actually behind now because I got the kill. A bit of wave XP. That's good. You want to stay ahead of her. As long as you're ahead or equal with her by the time you get your form, the game will go very smoothly. If you're a little bit behind, you have to play a little bit more smart. See, I'm not looking to make this hard for you. I'm trying to tell you how you can do this as easy as possible, but there will be hard games into these matchups. Even a free matchup can be very hard. There's a lot of things that can go right, right or wrong in a game, right? Watch out, bring out where Lily is. Obviously, she's on her bot side, her camps respawn. She's farming, she has five stack passive, she'll be fast. She's holding for her right now, I think. Yeah. Try and do something. I'll shove this. Goldie. Sometimes your team will listen to you, sometimes not. It's whatever. And it's gonna come. Hold you. He's three and one, so he wants to be cocky. I mean, that's just expected. Even how you look black like this. Uh, does he go? Does she go for this? He's not. Okay. Doesn't look like. It. So looking for her own camps. Very silly by Lolia there. Good uh, Diana. Hit pressure. Could have got a free camp. Every camp that she doesn't get for free, I get for free, and that's just punishment for her. Farm Wolf's here first. I want to farm Blue and Grom at the same time, so I'll wait for it to spawn. Yeah, so she's just farming all her topside camps. I'm farming all my topside camps and probably meet back bot. The little rendezvous. Karath Mai never plays Red Pain? What? Karath Mai? Why do you never play Red Pain? Um, I played Red Pain last game. Most games you don't play Red Pain, high though. Cool. Wow, I was not expecting that. Uh, I should've just ran far away. That's my bad. It sucks to give that up, but I should've just given it up. Better than not dying. We have shoving here. No oh, Lilia, they stay, they die. Okay. Right, let's just dive. Right. Hold on to my W. There it is. Oh. Oh, I'm just done. Uh, fucking hell. No, I get four. Nice. Yeah, she's four now. Rushing arm guard, like I said. All right, nice. 
Graven used flash there. Looking for the dragon. Okay, now she's going back to the dragon. It's quite low, it doesn't have stopwatch. I'm gonna die here, but let's just see if I get anything. Oh. I hit Draven at least. No, not even hit him. Ah, it sucks. Alright, we rush Prowlers. That was really worth it though, I got the dragon. See, just time your smites with like the highest damaging ability there. Time it with, uh, you know, Swain burst alongside with Lilia's E and my W. Do it right as, right as it happens and you should be good. Usually smite battles, if it's too smart junglers, it comes down to ping difference. They've got better ping, you know, faster. I mean, someone's from Chicago, they got NMS. Good win. Maybe some people just get nervous. Alright, well, we get form now, so we should just be able to snowball. Every time my ult is up, I should get a kill, and then every time I have Prowlers and it's up, I should get a kill, so. Nice. Good counter engage there. They might be getting engaged on, though. No, 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 that's good. Prompt and die. Oh, there you go. Nice. Now I'm 4 out of 5 Revenant Thunder stacks. Hi. Hey, you do. If she's got arm guard, so just with my R, I can't solo kill her. But she can't kill me because I have my R. Whenever she ults you, just save your ult. Then. I catch her when she's low HP or something. I just have no mid cryo. Oh, I accidentally showed myself there. That was really bad. Pretty good damage to her. Take her camps, and now we can look for a bot player again. Oh, look at Thrash. She's so overextended there. I think they hit any CC. Oh, it doesn't matter because we're zoning. to get this spot scuttle. No point in having a defensive control ward, I'll have an aggressive one. Put it right there. So what I should do is do this. See Lilia. Might just be doing Rift right now. If I see Rift is dead, I'm just gonna dive bot immediately. I see Grop is gone. Yeah, I had a feeling. He just did Rift. Bad, did he get form before 11? Yeah, I got form at 10. Nice. Wonderful. Hey, kitty, how's it going? I think Lilia wins that 1v1 against Rumble. Level 9 is 11. Notice they just fall apart. The Lilias. She's never stronger than me, so she can never be where I'm at because I'll always win the fights against her. Unless she gets like an amazing 3 man R, but you have to be very dumb to like line up for a 3 man R. I can just invade her whenever. She has a lot of mobility, but I do too. I'm staying here with a lot of gold. This is very risky. Put an even deeper forward. This is just to defend me so I can get a run. This is huge. Save Smite for the dragon. Oh, okay, we see her. Very tilted, so yeah. 
It's gonna try and team fight or something. Okay, control ward. Okay. Blue pots are a necessity. Control wards, necessity. Brawler's claw, necessity. DR boots, necessity. Everything else, pretty much situational. Am I gonna get shield breaker, aka serpents? Yes, because they have Diana and Thresh. And Draven's going shield bow. Easy shields to break. Alright, let's do the dragon. We got a good dragon soul here. Found him? Yeah, it's good. Vins is just proxying both waves. I just kill him. I have the highest mobility on the team. He can't slow me as long as I E before he puts his root down. If you E, it makes your immune to slows. And I get full HP just from farming. With Ravenous Hunter, my E, quite good, quite good. Fighting an awful lot here. Oh god, he saw a shield bow. <laughs> Jesus, the healing he got there was so insane. Ah. Uh, about the shield bro. My bad. It could have lived. I should just play the live there. After I get uh serpents, I'm gonna get Yumus. Don't or not Yumus, uh, Edge Knight. You don't need to rush Edge Knight because like I said, if Lily ever tries to ult you, just ult her ult someone. Oh, can't start her ult. Easy. Mm. I'm up like 30 CS. Normally, sh really I should never fall behind in CS, but eh, that's what happens. I think for picks, it's always good to get wards in these. Okay. Yeah, I shouldn't have used flash for the 0 and 9 Diana. Oof. Yo, what's up, humble soul? It's gone. I like, feels like Singe gonna come. He's already here. Yeah, he is. Team fight for the dragon, we should be good. I don't think that's gonna make it all the way over here. Wolf is too slow. That's right, fine. I'm just gonna reset before uh, dragon spawns, anyways. 
Uncle Frumble does damage. I'd probably kill Singed. Nice! Come with a little combo, now I get Dragon. I'll farm red before I do that. Yeah, getting kills. Getting fed to the point where you can get kills without your uh, ult is very important. I'll probably shove out bot lane right now. So just play off the dragons, we should be good. You do Baron really easy with the Astro Wind Wall and Rumble Burn. Sheesh! Get that boy fast. I just farm singed, it's easy. It's like AP singed. It's very good at a side lane roll. Just when it gets to this stage of the game. Oh, GG. That's how you play the Lilia, guys. <laughs> easy.